Only the vow of fidelity prevents me from accepting your invitation. Oh, Marquis, you mustn't leave now. Unfortunately, my lady, my duty compels me elsewhere. Ooh, smooth. Ooh, even smoother. Oh. Damn. Who's fetching, was she not? I hadn't noticed. That is because you are not a Frenchman. You are the most American Frenchman I have ever known. I am a lover of liberty, mon ami. A proper knight must learn to curb his passions. Without passion, monsieur. A man cannot fight. We do not fight men, Marquis. Men, half-breeds, what does it matter? Give la liberté. Those subtitles are really giving me a hard time here. They're so small. Uh-oh. Ah, small. So he's seeing his buddy doing something. Strange. That strange, apparently. <sighs> this game is still gorgeous. Still really unbelievably Let's gorgeous. Go. It's about time. Hey! About time, my left foot. Marquis, you and Lady Green take that entrance. I'll go through this one and sweep for any remaining escapees. Sir. Yeah. Pursue the remaining escapees. To all knights in the vicinity of Mesa. The Metropolitan Police has finished cordoning off the affected areas. Sentinels are continuing their overhead sweep. We will alert you to any sightings of the escaped patients. Acknowledge. Uh, I'm just gonna go straight. That looks very ominous. Galahad, are you making any headway? I'm in the generator room. Lafayette and I have decided to split our search. Women, mademoiselle, but I have not met any resistance yet. Ah, very atmospheric. Yay, traversal! Time to shoot you. Everyone, one of our escape pieces are half breeds. Oh, that looks painful. That looks painful. It's not as much as this is gonna hurt. I'm about to do it to him. Come on down, doggy. Make that more than one. Alright, come on now. I got some kibbles and bitch for you. I'm not dead. Are you okay? Oh, damn it. My bad. It may take me some time to reach him. Come on. Come on back out here. Oh, come on. I totally had him. Fine. You know what? Watch me do this. Try that again, homie. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You get it. Get it. Oh! Yeah. What you got? Come on, doggy. Come on, where ya? Okay, I did not mean that. Got to learn to quick time events, baby. Quick time events. Come on, homie. Yeah, you were down. Yeah, fuck your ribs. Yeah, you take that. You take it. Yeah. Who's next? You got another one, homie? Hold on. 
I'm there's there. another one of you right here. There you are. How you doing? Good to see you. <sighs> you son of a bitch. Try that again. No, don't try it again. Come on. You missed. Try it again. Come on, homie. Come on. You missed again. Come on. Where you at? Yeah! What you got? You got nothing! Oh, 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 okay. Maybe you got something. Yeah, get after it. Get after it. Monsieur! What happened? I slew most of them. The last one got away. Hey, Grain, I need your upcome. I'll head up to street level and keep after him. You two go that way and head him off. Understood. Yeah. I think that's Michael J. Fox. From now on, they shall be called Teen Wolf. Come on, ugly. Don't run. I know you ugly, but don't run. It's okay. We need to press forward. Oh, don't stop me from chasing him down there. Here we go. Here we go. Out of the way. Oh! 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 Almost guarantee you that had to hurt a little bit. Everyone, all right? Yes. Percival, we've neutralized the threat on our side. Good. I managed to capture one of the half breeds. Rendezvous back at Regent. Acknowledge. Let's go. So why doesn't he turn now? I don't get it. Like, is it like they did it trigger or something? If they got him? Seriously. I thought the order of Her Majesty's Royal Knights might be mixed up in this affray. We had reason to suspect a what? Affray? What's affray? An elementary conjecture. In that event, perhaps this might be of interest. White Chapel. Purely circumstantial, of course. I call it evidence. Well, circumstantial evidence can be a tricky animal, my dear Sir Percival. You may think it is pointing at one thing, but shift your point of view slightly, and you may find it pointing in an equally uncompromising manner at something entirely different. Please, indulge me with your musings, Commissioner. Well, first the rebellion, and then this Jack, and the Ripper murders, mm -hmm. and then this. Strange, don't you think, that Whitechapel has become the epicenter of our recent conundrums? We must examine every clue now, you see? We meet in council two days hence. If you would do us the honor of presenting your findings, you can expect me at Westminster. Over here, sir. At Westminster? Isn't that a church? That's so cool. Whatever you mean. Little London traffic. <laughs> What of the other half-breeds that escaped through Hyde Park? We must pursue them. No. Notre devoir est de les poursuivre, monsieur. Marquis. Mes chercheurs sont pas des Anglais, c'est nous par contre non. Votre témérité sera requis à un moment opportun. Can barely read those subtitles. Advice. I'm sure you will appreciate that for the time being, this must remain a police matter. Of course. Something's amiss. The blood in Whitechapel is known to give safe harbor to the rebellion. Precisely what troubles me. Why would so many half breeds be found in Bedlam? Something we need to find out for ourselves. You have heard, Commissioner Doyle. It's a police investigation now. Knights do not relinquish their authority to bureaucrats. Percival is right. This matter should be brought before the council. Centuries have passed, but our order has remained steadfast.
in its sacred mission to preserve the balance between man and half-breed. Such was the quest of our founder, King Arthur. Whoop, whoop. May his name be forever resplendent. Is it true? Did the Lord Chancellor fight by Arthur's side? That is the legend. Today, that balance is threatened with grave upset by a new contagion. The rebellion. As long as its campaign of anarchy and terror is allowed to continue, the plague of lichen infestation that has infected our city will only grow more intolerable. Well, the Lord Chancellor will thus agree to the urgency of a mission into Whitechapel. Whitechapel is a matter for the civil authorities. When the noble Arthur sought to contest for Truage with the Roman Emperor Lucius, he did not trouble himself with issues of jurisdiction. Ooh. Do not presume to quote history <laughs> to me. Oh, he tried to put you in your place, and he I put you in your place. history than you shall ever know. Oh, 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 oh. 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 The threat to this order comes not only from without, but within. Oh, yeah. We must stand vigilant together. Lest our ranks be poisoned by those who seek the destruction of all we hold sacred. No, no one is immune from the rebel's influence. Surely the Lord Chancellor does not mean to question Sir Percival's loyalty. This order has long appreciated Sir Percival's counsel. But the current disruption calls for caution and concerted effort, not rash action. Sir Percival has cause, Lord Chancellor. The situation in Whitechapel may need to be addressed. Does Lord Darwin speak with the blessing of the peers? Charles Darwin! Lord Hastings, Lord Dunglass. He does, Lord Chancellor. Perhaps the question should be put to the council. Very well. What says the order of Her Majesty's royal knights in the matter of Whitechapel? Aye or nay? Nay. nay. The nays have it. How did he get that? Is from just this 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 didn't count anything. Our order grows too prudent, Grayson. We wither away from this inaction. Leave it, Sebastian. Caution be damned. Uh oh. Sir Percival is most agitated. You should learn it is best not to cross him when his mind is set on something. Oh boy. Sir Percival seems intent on pursuing his investigation. You heard the Lord Chancellor. The council will not stand. You cannot deny that there is some truth to what Percival has said. Need I remind you of your place, Lady Egwene? Who are you to question the council's wisdom? Yes, Lord Chancellor. Ooh, everybody trying to get up in there. All right. Do you believe the evidence enough to warrant our involvement? God, this game looks good. Man, I had will deal with this in due time. I have a more pressing matter to attend. As you wish. How many of us will make the journey to America? Uh, Lord Barrett, Lord Darwin, and myself. I've heard many great things about the Agamemnon, Lord Hastings. Oh, she is the finest the United India Company has ever built. I can promise you a pleasant and speedy journey across the Atlantic. Can we, can we expect your presence at the launch? Sir Lucan. It would be my honor to see you off on your maiden voyage, my lords. Sir Lucan, if I may. Um, you you may make me, my lords. Of course, Sir Percival. Alistair, you, you know as well as I do that Whitechapel is the key to these disturbances, to everything. My opinion is immaterial. The Council has spoken. Few dared countermand your father's express wishes. Need I remind you that we all serve at the Lord Chancellor's pleasure? You, you are the Knight Commander! Make him see reason. You think an incursion into a rebel stronghold is reasonable? I consider it an acceptable risk. One for which you'd be willing to accept full responsibility should unforeseen circumstances arise. Let what befalls be upon my head. No one else's. Whitechapel remains off limits. That is officially. 
You have my thanks, Sir Logan. Of your thanks, I have no need. Bring me results. This is the Night Commander wishes. Ooh, whoa! Insubordination FTW! I guess, I don't know. Well, we're going in. Most, Most excellent. When do we move? No. Not talking about Whitechapel. Your brother sought fit to permit us a reconnaissance. Secure the necessary materials. Isabeau, a word. Tell, Tell me, monsieur. monsieur. About, about the Lord Chancellor. Chancellor. What is a Marquis? Sir Lord and Lady Lorraine were adopted by him, yes. As they were. Why would he ruin this such struggle? Perhaps he wanted to regain a semblance of the humanity he lost. When time, the time came to join the Order, the choice was theirs to make. Regardless, I will not wish this life on my children. Marquis, we need to hurry. Oui, mon général, avec plaisir. Monsieur. English, motherfucker, do you speak it? Friend Mallory has always been something of a rogue operative. I've never known a better man. Still, I shall rely on you to be a, call it a sobering influence. Sebastian and I have long been partners. I trust him with my life. A little restraint would not, not be ill-advised. Do look after my sister, won't you? No, no man in the realm can keep Isabeau from danger when she's of a mind. Oh, you say true. What's a brother to do, eh? Good luck and Godspeed. I swear, if I, you know, I mean, if I'm not paying attention, I'm gonna get lost in this English. At your service, Sir Gallagher. This way, please. Where'd he come from? Just the man. Where did he come from? All of a sudden, Nikola Tesla was just right there? What's up with that? What new developments do you have to show me? Quite a few intriguing things, things, if I may say so. Any further news of the uh, trouble in Grosvenor Square? Police are investigating. And investigating. Lichens. On the United India Company's front doorstep. What do you make of it? Maybe it's what it used to be. This dude is very gruff. Permit uh, me to oversee a few of my new experiments. Uh, in the meanwhile, take a look around. Uh, Play with whatever strikes your fancy, but do, do be careful. Catacombs of Westminster. Okay, so I'm supposed to look around for something and just have some fun here? Okay. Like this. Quite an antique. Hard to believe we ever use these communicators. Interesting. I have no idea what I'm looking at. Good job. Not a clue. Alright, uh, so walk around, walk around, walk around, walk around. Nothing there? Okay. Seems I'm supposed to look around and I have no idea what I'm supposed to be looking at. We are uncertain as to what. Hey look, a gun. Why do I have a feeling I'll be going back to where that is? All right, let's see. Anything over here I can look at? No. Oh, wait, there was something. There you go. Look at that. Hmm. More gibberish to me. Nicola. You sly dog. So you mean to tell me that Nikola Tesla, one of the greatest inventors of all time, was a hound dog getting his freak on at Obel Musès? Well, all right, and they're all sizes plump and petite. Well, go on with your best self, Nicola. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'll tickle your Tesla. Ooh. I don't know. Is that what they say? I don't know. Well, now what? Oh, there's something. Nicola. How fares your friend Edison these days? Thomas and I are not on speaking terms. The man is an idiot! 
He actually drew something on his head, too. Very reminiscent of, shall we say, uh... What is it? Oh, yeah, the Prestige. Very much like the Prestige. That's cool. Alright, now what? Is there anything else to look at around here? Oh, wait. Am I supposed to come here? Or? Galahad! Please, this way. Okay. This is something you may find interesting. This device allows you to convert between Edison's inefficient direct current and my superior alternating current. Quite handy for overloading and incapacitating certain electrical systems. Meaning what? It's comprised of an inverter, transformer, and rectifier outfitted with some brass clips to enhance the design. Oh, and a fine leather carrying case. Inside each tube is a small quantity of mercury. When the mercury is properly aligned, the device becomes operational. Please, try it. supposed to hold those. You never cease to amaze, Nicola. I have no idea what he just did. Not a clue. Your expert opinion on my latest whimsy. Hey, did I not say I was going to come back to that? Impressive. You've always had a good eye for craftsmanship. I've outfitted this one with a telescopic sight. It's ideal for long-range shooting. I would be honored if uh, you would test its efficacy. Efficacy? All right. Recoil is sharp. Manageable. I should not be a sniper. You may want to avail yourself of the variable magnification. There you go, okay. And, uh, wow, I am no sniper. Some muffling might be in order as well. I'll attend to it immediately. So, are there any other of my children that you would like to meet? The offer's tempting, but I must return to the others. Of course. Oh, the monocular that uh, General Lafayette requested is over there on the table. I'll see that he gets it. Yeah! I have no idea, idea what just happened. We scour the district in pairs. Isabeau, you and Lafayette take the high street from the south end. Galahad and I will move in from the north. Why not give the Frenchman to Galahad? Mademoiselle doubts my intentions. I promise to remain at all times the picture of chivalry. Chivalry! I prefer to have someone more experienced looking out for me. I thought you needed no looking after. Very well. Ooh. You team with Galahad. Mademoiselle will perhaps one day allow me to demonstrate my skill. One day? Remember. We are entering rebel territory. The insurgents will take umbrage at our incursion into Whitechapel. Even on our little discovery in Mayfair, the London hospital should be our target. Strange to think Lycans would find sanctuary here, is it not? Yes, you really believe the rebels are collaborating with the half-breeds? The Lord Chancellor is convinced of it. I have my doubts. Do you trust anyone, Mon General? Never accept. Always question. It's a motto that's seen me through the centuries. Stay vigilant, all of you. We can expect hot work here. Ah, quelle joie!